Hello, hello. Welcome in, welcome in. How are you all doing? I am going to be streaming more Minecraft. Hello, hello. Ah, I've got Echo. I forgot to do that. Sorry about that. Uh, I hope uh, everyone is doing well. I am uh, going to be doing uh, more Minecraft. <coughs> my Minecraft tonight. I think I'm having an allergy attack. My eye is all swollen and stuff. <clears throat> it's really great. So, um, just uh, dealing with that. So, um, so yeah, I will be doing uh, that barn. I'm going to be finishing up that barn tonight. And uh, thank you very much for the like, Matt. Welcome in. How are you doing? And uh, hey, Rebecca, I'm doing well. How are you doing? Thank you for asking. And uh, thank you for the like. And, uh, yes, hydration. Oh, I didn't do the thing. I should have, when I drank it, I should have, uh... Ah, that's good water. Mm. Or did I just... I just double hit it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, uh... I think I have some weird allergic reaction. I, uh, took a nap this evening and woke up and my eyelid's all swollen. It's beautiful, I have to say. So, <laughs> but, uh... But yeah, uh, so uh, how are you doing, Rebecca? Let me get this uh, to crop to camera. So we can see chat. I can actually get my headphones on. So I actually hear when I do the voices. Why is that blinking? There we go. And uh, thank you for the like, DN. Welcome in. Hello, hello. How are you doing? All right, there we go. Turn up. Minecraft is a little bit loud. Oh, I need to switch this to system. There we go. Hopefully that's going to be loud enough. Um, so, uh, yeah, I will be working more on that barn that I uh, was working on last night. And uh, I'm going to see how red cement works out. Um, I need to go on a sand expedition, unless someone else has already grabbed some sand. <laughs> so... Um, I do have Benadryl. I haven't taken any because I figured, well, I have to stream. And falling asleep on stream because Benadryl, that probably a bad thing. So if this continues, I'll probably just, uh, I'll take some to get me to go to sleep, I guess. <laughs> so that is, uh, that is the plan at least. So, um, but we'll see. And I'm just making sure all the alerts went out. They did not. There we go. Send that one, and then that should be better. There we go. Um, and I'll go back. Uh, I am surprised that the latency on Twitch, now that I'm streaming there, is just so much better as far as, you know, when I get alerts, I get them much faster on Twitch. So, and if I miss them, I can just jump over the Facebook, because that's like a 15-second delay. So, at times. Um... So let's go to this and uh, the timing on the alert there, the, the little call to action was, I did not do that on purpose. All right, so let's refresh. There are a couple people in there. I've noticed there were a few people playing this evening. So, um, oh, you know what? I needed to put an alert on There we go. And um, yeah, so tonight I also want to talk about potential more, um, uh, what's it called? More things, uh, more servers. Because this one, I mean, we have a lot of people and this is really well established who all is on. Okay, cool. Uh, I am streaming now. And hello. Um, and so, uh, something I want to do and, uh, Hey, uh, exterminator, how are you doing? Um, so something I am, uh, considering is, you know, another survival server, um, with a big kind of sanctuary zone, but the rest of it kind of PVP related, cause there's going to be a lot of people who like PVP and I will take a vote on that and see what the community thinks overall. But, you know, as far as the next server goes, I want it to kind of be a fresh and maybe do like seasonal things. So we have this OG server and there is uh, Sir Ben ZK. 
And uh, hey, uh, Watcha, how are you doing? Welcome in. Hello. And Sheriff Ricky Bobby, welcome in. And let's do uh, this. Yo. There's a new sheriff in town. Everyone, welcome Ricky Bobby. Figure I'd get a shout out because I haven't done a, much of a shout out for you, Ricky. So let's do this. I kind of hear that buzzing a little bit. So I have to readjust this mic. I think it's still, uh, it's doing that thing where it's buzzing just a tiny, tiny bit. And there's, uh, there's random humble. So we got two people. The two people on stream are here. Um, so, uh, so yeah, I will be, uh, I'm thinking of another server where not everyone has Elytra and Netherite, at least at first and do maybe a seasonal thing. So, you know, we have this server for all our big builds and doing things in a community and stuff, but we also have the other one as kind of a, you know, just, you know, a, a one that resets more often. So, and hey, ZK. And um, thank you uh, for the uh, the like, uh, Ricky Bobby. I appreciate that. Um, and also thank you for the share i appreciate that a lot thank you thank you so um and uh yeah tonight so my eye is swollen i woke up from a nap this evening and my whole eye is just kind of swollen i i had the window open too i think uh with the new you know with it being a little warmer out this past weekend there might be some uh stuff i'm allergic to certain things i don't even know what but uh whatever it was it came into the window and my eye is just kind of a little puffy tonight so it happens. But yeah, as far as the next server goes, I'm hoping, um, you know, it will, I'll, I'll do a vote and see, uh, let's see. Oh, what did I miss? Uh, random Hubble. Oh, got a gift. Oh, thank you. Um, uh, is that, let's, uh, take a look. Oh my goodness. That is a lot of sand. Wow. Let me, uh, Take that and hey DNs. Um, let me put that in here so that I can easily transfer this stuff. So thank you so much. That is a lot of sand. That is definitely enough for me to uh, do the concrete that I need to do for red. Because I think the mixture of red concrete and uh, terracotta will actually be amazing. So oh, amazing. What am I talking about? It'll actually be very good. <laughs> so um, I think the two combined will actually be, I was saying amazing in the fact that I got all the sand. Um, I think the two combined will actually look really nice. Not amazing, that might be overblowing it. Um, and here is your shulker box back. There you go. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. And uh, you should make a courthouse. And, ah, uh, yes, Elden Ring Day. I did actually think of that because my eye's puffy, and I'm like, Elden Ring's out. You know, will there be a lot of people who don't watch because they are playing Elden Ring? Because that is kind of a big release that uh, happened at 6 p.m. Um, this time, and so people would already be playing it unless you have a console, in which case it literally just launched 30 minutes ago. So, um, and how are you doing, Avery? Hope you are doing well. And uh, let's see. So also got shulkers of wood also if it's needed. Well, thank you very much. Thank you for all of that stuff. And so, you know, because I had my heat on, it masks the sound. It is interesting. It masks the sound of this buzzing. And it kind of... I want to minimize it as much as possible. So weird. All right. I'll have to mess with that another time. I just want to minimize it for this stream at least. So, um, but yeah, it seems. So what I discovered with uh, these mics is it picks up this buzz field. There's apparently a buzz field all around electricity. And uh, thank you for the like, Tucker. Welcome in. Hello, hello. How are you doing? And uh, let's see, Avery. I'll be playing tomorrow at like 11. 
you have a copy ready for pickup awesome very very cool very cool what are you gonna play it on because it's like available for every single possible um you know every console except i don't know about the switch but it's available everywhere so uh what um i assume if you're gonna pick up a copy you're playing it on like the playstation so i'm just trying to figure out there's a tiny i mean it's so slight with it here i'll, I'll just have to play around with that another time um it's good that you're good and uh you'll be playing uh on your phone uh ricky bobby uh minecraft so and hey cj welcome in hello how are you doing so let's do this and thank you very much for the like cj i appreciate that a ton thank you thank you all right so concrete i need to make some red concrete now the one good thing about a an iron farm is the massive amount of flowers that get dropped i mean you normally think oh that's just garbage but in this situation when i'm making a ton of red concrete having an iron farm with a thousand red flowers is actually a really good thing so uh ps4 because ps5 is literally impossible to get that is extremely true um i've wanted one for a while and uh nope no luck i won't be getting one for quite some time oh this is all oh i see what happened here that's interesting so let's let's do this there we go where are the flowers oh i'm guessing the flowers have been cleaned out and put somewhere or destroyed which is also very likely so it's a good thing it's dropping a whole bunch though <laughs> so um make a wither rose farm we actually have one. Oh, what's going on here oh there's a skeleton horse on the uh scaffolding of course you know because that's that happens um let's see yeah there's nothing there and i'm just gonna fall off ah, all right um i guess that'll be enough flowers for now 30 might be enough i'm not sure i should have some more though somewhere and uh thank you very much for the like uh nice one am i pronouncing that right because i see it i see a nice one so um you gotta go you'll be in trouble well thank you for dropping by tucker i appreciate you uh stopping by and uh thank you very much for the follow nirvana welcome in how are you doing nirvana and so let's see oh you lost all your stuff dns oh man um you start over because kind of like uh that is the minecraft way when you lose all your stuff and that's another thing about the uh next server i'm gonna make sure like people don't have the uh best settings and get to keep their stuff on death because there are a few of us the admins and um yeah figure a server that we would restart you know or refresh every six weeks or so for per season and just have it you know so we do the dragon and we build up stuff and then we reset but we always have this one so um you have a good day too tucker and thanks for visiting all right let's see do i have flowers in here oh i've got plenty of red dye that works too that will work very very well so let's do this get some more um do i want to pvp right now not at the moment i do not let's see and that's another thing i'm going to do a vote on the server for pvp to see how many people actually like it to see if we do because i can go either way with it i can set the world to be no pvp with zones entire zones to be pvp or I can set the whole world to be PVP with zones that are sanctuary, sanctuary. So, um, Nirvana Onana, that's what you said. So, hello, Nirvana, welcome in. How are you? And um, nice one. I am on uh, 1.18, and this actually works. This server works for both Bedrock and Java. So, no matter what you play on you can access this server um the description in the description of the stream is are all the connections to the server as well as the connection to my discord which i always uh, have all the Let's connections see. there we go and so usually what i do is i pin a comment i'll put the discord first in chat but i'm going to pin the 
um uh the thing before joining on bedrock and joining on java those will be put on there there we go and i'm going to pin there we go i'm pinning the connection for the uh server so that is how to connect and the discord is there so that you can um access the discord and chat and you can also see further instructions on joining the server and all the rules and stuff like that so that is all on the discord server so um i need to make concrete oh the other thing i need eh, that i have none of zero zilch and that is i have no gravel I've got two gravel. I can make two blocks of cement. <laughs> um, I'm going to have to find a gravel island of sorts. Wait, what's this? Is that gravel? No, it's polished basalt. Okay, so I'm going to... Let's look at the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. Where are you, map? Survival map. There you are. And then let's look and see if we can find, I think, does it label the zones? No, just mouse over. So a gravel place, like a gravel beach, would be what I'm looking for. So maybe something like this. That could be a stone beach. It could be a gravel beach. But I need gravel. So that is there. And I do have my elytra, so that'll save some time flying there. Um, a lot of stone beach. This could all be gravel in this area. So I'm actually going to fly to these areas and see. So that is like southwest of spawn from where I am. So this is our map. For those of you who haven't seen it, this is our online map. Our server has a map and you can see where everything is. And so this is the Colosseum that uh, Golden built and I put into the server via a schematic. And I see HDZ put in some uh, Among Us, HDZ. And HDZ is also going to build a big square island right here. And that's why I don't want to get rid of this server, certainly. I do want to keep this one. I'm going to uh, do that. And uh, hey, uh, Dan, the nether shock. Look where people have been nether mining. There's patches around them. You patches of gravel or just patches of where people have been mining because I'm somewhat guilty of doing a mine path but I tried to patch up where I went and then I just kind of went crazy so it doesn't tell me if this is a gravel beach because those gravel beaches are really nice for getting a ton of gravel so we've got two and they're both the southwest and then one to the north west from there so we are going to check those out so let's get rid of that. I actually remembered to get rid of the map this time. And so let's get my wings. Let's see. So there's the wings. I'm actually going to put away so that I have room all this stuff because I'm not going to need it. Forgive me, Chris, for messing up the organization again. I will clean that up. I promise. All right, so I don't know why I have an iron pickaxe. I guess just as an extra. Um, so let's see. Gravel. Oh, the nether. Look where people have been nether mining. There's patches around them. Probably not a lot, though, of gravel. Um, is there a way to make gravel? I mean, it's. I think gravel is just a resource you find on the ground. So uh, the other thing I need are fireworks wait were they 17 fireworks that's probably enough oh 14 more here we go all right that should be good hopefully so let's go here and so i'm going to head southwest so it's going to be like right towards the light tower well i should oops wrong thing there we go oh and thank you. Uh, thank you, Dan. I do need them. <laughs> so I'm going to head southwest and hopefully find... I got to make sure I'm... Let's see. 
continuing to go in at least the right semi right direction. It should be southwest from spawn as long as I'm going the right way. And I would look at the map, but I will then crash and die. Actually, you know what? Let's do it while I'm over water really quick and see where I am. I am missing it by a little bit. Kind of going in the right way. So it should be around here. There we go. I don't know if this is gravel or just a stone beach, but worth a shot because, yeah, it looks like stone. All right. Looks like it's only stone, and then to the northwest will be more. It's hard to tell when you're looking at the map. Actually, here's some gravel and some coal. That's actually nice. Let's get some coal. I actually need that. And what is this zone called? It is called a stony shore. Okay. And let's get all the gravel. Every single bit of it. This will actually help a lot. This actually might be enough. Um, and I do like getting... So actually, you know what? I don't have any... Do I have... I do have arrows. I was thinking I was out, but I don't have my infinity bow, so I need to make more arrows. Oh, and thank you. I appreciate that. Let me uh, get back up there to grab what you have in the shulker box. Let's see. Oh, thank you. Goodness. All right, I'll take two stacks. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. That will help a ton, as I don't have much of a way of getting around right now. So, and that is, you know, I mean, we are all really stacked on this server. Like, anyone new joining will be like, why am I so far behind? <laughs> so, it's kind of like, you know, that's one of the other reasons. Like, having a server with seasons that just uh, restarts every once in a while is something I want to do. So the creeper farm, yeah, I've, I've actually I've heard other people say that it is quite amazing. So let's see, that is a stack and a half. So I'm going to go northwest. So that would be that way to go do some more. Let's see. And uh, hey, Ricky Bobby, what's up? Let's see. So here's another stony shore. Let's see if we can get some more gravel. Let's see. Maybe some over here. I think I saw. No. If someone was here, though. I see cobble. Oh, there's a nice little thing in there. Let's go ahead and jump down. Again, having that uh, uh, fall thing, the uh, feather falling, is like the best thing ever. Oof. Okay, we don't want to jump in there. Uh, I don't see any gravel necessarily in this whole area. So let's go back up and uh, look for something up there. So this is all in the name of getting cement, or I call it cement, getting concrete, so that I can uh, make red concrete. So let's see if we have anything on this shore, and then I think I'm going to have to look at the map again to see where the next possible spot. There's some more coal, but I'm gonna pass up. I'm not gonna pass up on this coal because it is literally right in front of me. And uh, hey, Wacky Gamer, it's okay if you're a little late, that's fine. You're never late if I'm still streaming. So I uh, appreciate you dropping by. How are you doing tonight, Wacky Gamer? Or today, rather, as it were? Or is it tonight for you? I'm not sure what time it is for you in the world. Um, I hope someone's near bed. That would be cool, even though it's not too much of a deal now that we're back on normal. <laughs> so um, let's see. Get some sand accidentally, but get all the gravel. There we go. Actually, you can make gravel. Well, I'm trying to remember the best way of doing it. Smashing a donut. It's today in your country. Okay. All right. That is cool, and of course, thank you, Dan, for sleeping. I do appreciate that a lot. Oh, I'm going to the wrong thing. I was looking for the map and seeing... Let's see, so I've already been to the south, maybe? Was that where I came from? I'm just going to go more southwest, because there's more shores that way. Southwest, there's actually a lot more that way, so... 
We will check that out next for gravel. Let me see. I can't even remember how much gravel is needed. Um, let's see. So I have, how much do I have now? I have two stacks plus 10. So let's go with this. I want to go southwest. Right along these shores. Here's some more. Looks like stone. I almost went and hit that rock. There we go. There's some, that's a good amount of gravel. So there is a place called Gravel Shore or something, but this is still not Gravel Shore, but something about gravel. But this is, this is a lot of gravel. This is nice. And this shovel is awesome, I have to say. I have to make sure I keep this. Um, I should put men mending on it to always have this shovel. <laughs> so I love how fast it just goes right through. Hey, and look, there's uh, more coal. More coal, the better. Because everyone needs coal. That's one of the resources we don't have a whole lot of. It's like one of those things that used to be much easier to find. Um, I remember in our early game when we first started, it was like trying to find coal was terrible, which is why I wanted to do a kelp farm because kelp farm, uh, kelp is so much better for um, stoves and stuff. It, it, uh, it's, it actually cooks more blocks. So this keeps going and going. Of course, I'm underwater and I don't have my Aqua Affinity Helm anymore. So this slows down a ton and I will drown. So let's get back up and get the other stuff up here. So, but, uh, so how is everyone's day going wherever you are in the world? It's been, uh, today here, we uh, had like 75 degree weather yesterday and now it's 75 Fahrenheit. And uh, 75 Celsius would be boiling. Well, not wouldn't be boiling, but it'd be pretty darn cold or cold, hot. Um, and uh, you're going to go mining for some coal. Cool. Okay, Ricky. Yeah, I mean, I, I do have some, but I always run out because I'm always cooking random things like sand so I can make all that glass that I needed. Whoops. And um, let's see, do I have? Okay, good. There we go, and let's get to this. Um, but yeah, it dropped 40 degrees from yesterday. Um, again, Fahrenheit. Um, but you have a lava farm. Oh, okay. So, all right. So, yeah, basically, um, yeah, we went from 75 to 35 in less than 24 hours. And so we've got, like sleet and snow and all that fun stuff going on right now so but not enough that i will they'll close my work tomorrow which would have been awesome but it's supposed to like warm up by 2 a.m here and it's just be all rain so you can get charcoal from yeah from wood i could do that that is very true um but i like saving wood too <laughs> so it's kind of like one of those things but yeah, you can always cook wood, get charcoal, make torches and stuff. That is one of the alternative ways, but I never really think of that. I always want the coal because the coal does, I think it cooks a little bit, cooks a few more blocks, I want to say. This is actually a really good beach for uh, gravel, though, I'll have to say. This has been uh, so far very good. Let's see. Let's see how much I ended up with. So, wow, that's a lot of stacks. I think I'm good. I think I'm actually good on uh, gravel now. Maybe. I'll we'll have to go back and see. Because I can't even pick that up now. And there's some in the water. Let's see, what can I throw? I'll just throw my netherite into the water. I don't need that, right? Let's throw the sand. Oh. And then let's get the gravel that is floating out in the water. I don't want the sand. But I do want all this. And all that. Because why not? I'm here. There we go. Let's go get that. And uh, hey, uh, Roeote, how are you doing? You just got refunded on your broken Model O and got a Model D. Awesome. Very cool. Very cool. Um, yeah, this has actually been an amazing place to get gravel. Um, this uh, one little beach. The first one was okay. This one is outstanding. So 
I have to say, this one, uh, this is very good. And there's even more underwater, except the problem is it's underwater. And uh, digging underwater is no bueno. All right. So this server is located in California. So, and hey, uh, Nihal, how are you doing? And uh, this is uh, both Java and, and Bedrock. It'll work for both. So all are welcome who uh, follow, you know, on YouTube, subscribe, watch the streams. It's, uh, yeah, everyone is welcome. So, um, yes, I do see what is happening in the Ukraine. But we do not need to uh, necessarily talk about it. You're getting seven ping. Well, you are in, uh, you said last night, you're in Los Angeles. Yeah, so this, the server's in, uh, it is in uh, San Jose. So, um, Nihal, it's all in the uh, description for both uh, Bedrock and Java. So, there is a port number um, in the description. So, um, you'll love how the copper blocks look. They are, they, yes, they are pretty. And then also, if you have a bee farm and you get the wax, you can wax the copper blocks to keep them that color, or they start to turn uh, green. So, but, uh, yeah, let's, uh, yeah, as far as I, I do see what the world events are and it's, you know, it's sad. My thoughts are with all the people involved, but let's, uh, let's do some Minecraft and, and, uh, just kind of, uh, I mean, it sounds a little, you know, to little glib to just say let's think about something else but at the same time uh, this there's enough in this world to think about that's bad so um you watch stream so you can re refrain from the stress yes you are welcome you are welcome that is uh it's another reason why i also stream because it, it actually helps kind of uh you know de-stress from the world so what did uh let's see you found a cave. Nice. With a dungeon. Wow, that was fast. All right. Get rid of that guy. All right, so I need to go now northeast. So let's do that. Your Minecraft name is Solomon Fire. Okay. Yeah, go ahead and uh, join. You do, don't need to be a friend or anything. Oh, it's a thunderstorm. I've never flown in a thunderstorm before, so here we go. Let's head back northeast. Uh, keep inventory is not on. Um, it is for admins by kind of by accident. Um, I'm not complaining, <laughs> um, but uh, it is not on. So, okay, well, uh, enjoy uh, enjoy your bath, wacky. Thank you for uh, joining the server, and I'll see you later. All right, so I hope I'm heading the right direction. I hope. Should probably not use, okay, there we go, HDZ, and there's the, the, the hand pointing in the air. So that means I'm very close to spawn, there it is. So and there's my house. So let's fly on through if I can make it, there we go. And the barn. And let's come in for a nice landing and not die. Oof, so I smash my head into the wall. It's always good landing when you smash your head into the wall of your door. All right, so let's see. I've got more than enough gravel now. That is kind of crazy. Um, let's see, yeah, I've got all of it are stacks. I don't have any half stacks. Put those two in with it. So we're going to keep some. And let's see. It is uh, kind of cool to hear uh, 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 Re Riyadh um, that uh, you have that good of a ping. You have the best ping on the server. There are people on this server who, uh, or Roeo, sorry, who don't have uh, very good pings at all. But yeah, you're at 32 now. I'm at 71 on the East Coast. And uh, thank you very much for the uh, the like, JC. Welcome in. How was your stream tonight? How did uh, the rest of uh, Among Us go? All right. So I'm going to put back my wings so that I don't 
lose them. Oh, we technically can't. Um, let's go with this. And there we go. There's our usual thing from uh, YouTube that happens every once in a while with the chat. Vum ung. All right, let's block. And then let's restream. So Royo. Uh there we go. Yeah, I get that on on my chat every once in a while on YouTube. It's just totally random. So alright. Oh oh you just crashed. Okay. So that's why you went. Went away. Alright. So let's go and let's add some sand. Let's leave an open spot, and I'll actually sleep so that we advance the day. So, sorry here you crashed. I mean, I wonder if it was the thunderstorm in-game was causing some issues. Oh, I am mix missing. What's the other ingredient? Um, I guess you have to have a color. Maybe, perhaps. Let's see. I threw everything randomly in here. I think that's all I need. Oh, it was a cord. Oh, okay. Let's see. There we go. Red concrete powder. There we are. And there. Okay. So let's put the this one little bit of cobble back because I don't need that. And then I do need... Oh, that's right. I put everything randomly away. I shouldn't have done that. Uh, let's do a stack. And let's just keep going with what we got. Um, in In game right now, there's actually five of us. Alan, and welcome in. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. Let's do this and that. That should be more than enough concrete, plus the terracotta. I should be good to go with this. And then I'll put all the gravel. Let's see. There we go. That, that. There we go. And let's see. When you broke out, you saw your name tag. Oh, you're AFK and then you almost died. Oh. Oh. All right. Interesting. Um, all right. Let's grab this. So actually, you know what? I don't need those because I've already done the walls. I just want to see how it looks. I'm thinking, what if I did stripes? Like, you know, wood panels. And I did it like this. I just want to see what it looks like. And let's see, red concrete powder. Oh, wait, that's red concrete powder. I do not want red concrete powder. I want to, okay, here we go. Let's do the tower that I did last night. This will take... A little while. I actually can't do it from the top. Oh, and I put my wings. Ah, oh, you know what? I'll just jump into the little pool of water that is off to the side. Or the hay bale. Do you think I'll survive a hay bale, hay bale drop from the top sky limit? Oh, you just got up headache. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Alan. I hope your headache goes away. That does suck when you wake up and you have a headache. I do, uh, I do feel you. You don't think I'll survive a uh, hay bale fall from the sky limit? I think I will. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, do, uh, do trapped. And that will work. All right. Yeah, there's no way I'm going to survive. But I'm going to try anyway. Because why not? It's fun, right? And I put my wings away, so I have no way to fly out of this. So... We're just going to do this so that I can get all the concrete that I need in the water. Oh, that was interesting. Just did an outline. What is our current? Okay, yeah, our server is good. So we're going to keep going up and up and up. Another thing I could try is red wool, but I was pretty sure I wanted the solid. And I think the two solid colors, the terracotta plus the concrete next to each other, are actually, they might look nice together. And uh, we'll see. Not amazing, as I stated earlier. Let's see. 
And uh, yeah, as far as uh, stuff you might need, uh, Royo, you can always get things from the spawn house if you need iron. There is a ton of iron, unless you want to do it the standard way. Okay, so one thing about jumping off of this is I may not be able to see where I'm going. So this is going to be very, 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 very interesting. Um, how and if I survive this, which Dan says I will not. I actually trust Dan on this one. I'm pretty sure I won't. But we're going to see what Feather Falling 4 on a... Um, on a... Uh, uh, Hey, bail will do. Am I at the limit? No, nowhere near. Oh, actually, I don't need. I can just look at the number that's in the middle of the screen. I do not need to look at the nether rack that is in the sky right there. This should be good enough. All right. So we keep going and going and going. Um, all right. We are almost there. 312, I believe, is the build limit. Yeah. Oh, no. I'm still going. I thought it was 312. Maybe it's 320. There we go. 320. Okay. We are at the build limit. All right. So now I have to jump off. I can't dig down because when you do the water, you have to cut it off from the bottom. So we're going to land on a hay bale and probably die, but why not try? We're jumping to the moon. <laughs> Let's see. There's the hay bale and I missed the hay bale. Oh. Well, I get to try again because I've got a lot of this stuff. So... <sighs> All right, that did not work out. I should have aimed a little bit better than that. <laughs> it told me so. You did, but I missed the hay bale. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put... Um, oh, I don't have the other one anymore. Oh, I just ran into the cactus. I should have landed on the cactus. That would have been instant death. All right, I won't be in water. That would be bad. So there we go. And just do this until it's all at the bottom. Yeah, that was an epic fail. That was really bad. <laughs> that was uh, that was extraordinarily sad. That fall. So, um, so just getting all of this concrete, and then I'll do it again. And this time I won't miss. However, I think falling will uh, still kill me. So, let's see. I am happy that concrete falls because, or the powdered concrete because if it didn't then this would be really bad so but uh oh did i got some server lag going on there um this is quite efficient though let's see where are we we're getting there oof um zk might have taken your sculpture box and your head just to let you know you didn't um you've been trying to get far out um did you where'd you put the skulker box shulker box rather yeah there we go let's see uh where did you put it down let's see curious amount of people with me because you see another streamer say no to picture items as it messes up the stream versus a text board um and hey wacky um done taking a bath maybe you can finish the stream today okay cool well, and also have fun at your cousin's house um oh you found it did you find it dk it was in your chest okay always good to uh look around and everything so um so curious i'm gonna go back to what you said alan uh, curious to the amount of people with me because you've seen another streamer say no to picture items. What do you mean picture items? Like the their uh, skins? I'm not sure what you mean. Or are you talking about like the um, when people do pixel art and stuff? So let's see. Maybe maps. I mean, there are maps and I mean, using picture. Now I will say streamers do say no to like auto sort, like sorting um, items and chests because that can have an extremely bad um, effect on the server. So, um, so you're referring to like these with the chests and everything. I mean, I, this is fine. 
It's just that if you do auto sorters, like if you have something that sorts the things to these chests, that will destroy the server. Like the server will die. So, um, and I've gotten that advice from, uh, from a couple people. All right. So let's see red concrete. So I'm actually going to first, before I go and do another, see how this all looks. So if I do stripes of red straight up and down, that actually might look good together like that. Or I could do it kind of, you know, randomly placed, kind of like how I did this wall. See how this is? I could do something like that um, with, you know, different color red, or I could make it like striped, like different boards, you know, when you have a barn and it's just kind of, striped like that i think that could look good maybe um though i think i have it backwards i think i will actually do the red concrete because the red concrete is a nicer red and then this you know kind of like i'll do two two stripes or three stripes of the red and then a little bit of this so it's kind of has a worn look to it i guess kind of again like that except done in more of a wood paneling kind of way I think that's what I'm going to do. Brick, I will use brick for accents. Like, I'm going to use brick around, you know, up there. I'm going to use some uh, uh, things to uh, designate that. And uh, thank you on uh, on Trovo. Thank you for the follow, uh, Shergar. Welcome in. Hello, hello. And um, I can indeed, ZK, are you at your... I will actually TP to you. I assume you're there. Oh, you are not. But yes, I can go and check any chest and look through. Um, I would recommend always securing your goods, your stuff, your chests to make sure people don't go into them. Um, so I actually TP to you. <laughs> so uh, lead the way where your chest is. Actually, you know, I'm going to advance daytime. So hold on one second or just keep going. I'll just teleport to you. That's actually better. A whole lot better. So, but yes, I will use brick for high or not highlights, uh, maybe highlights or, you know, different uh, parts of the building. So, all right, let's go back through here. Okay, running through John's property. This time I don't have the raid thing on. That was great when that happened. All right. So... All right, so CO inspect. And it looks like um, there you go. You can see it on screen. So, um, yeah, you definitely need to put claims on. And um, I'll say, uh, Royod, Royod, if you could bring back the stuff that you took, because um, unless, uh, did you say it was okay, ZK? like the spruce log and iron ingots and stuff like that. So C O L two looks like, uh, he's added stuff and removed things. Lapis emeralds, uh, C O L three and, uh, removed three diamond, a shulker box, totem of undying, well, no, it does say, um, oh, okay, that's you. So, yeah, um, Roya, if you could please. Oh, you thought that was someone else's? Okay. Um, yeah, this isn't claimed, so you got to make sure you claim your stuff. Um, if you could bring back the stuff you took from this chest, that would be awesome. Um, and you could see it was all on the stream. It's uh, So, yeah, it looks like... Uh, Totems of Undying, uh, uh, Spruce Planks, lots of Lapis, Emerald, uh, Diamond, Shield, Shulker Box, uh, Spruce Logs, Iron Ingo, we got a thousand. So, all right, there you go. And uh, I'll actually TP, or wait, who wants to TP to who? TP me to you. Okay, I can do TPs. He can't, but I can. And I'm right here. So there you go. To you. And there you go. 
I do love that uh, that inspect thing. It does uh, help figure out what's going on. So there you go, and he'll get you your stuff. He said he'll he's going to give it to you. So let's see. And uh, thank you very much for the like, Nestor. Welcome in. Hello. Um. Oh, you're gonna go now, wacky gamer. And uh, let's see. Um. Yes. Hello, Nestor. And yeah. So have fun at your cousin's house, wacky. And uh, let's see. And I'll see you at tomorrow's stream. And uh, would that be considered theft? It's it depends. It really depends because people are supposed to claim areas. So I I would almost consider that because we have these open chest areas for people to just take things. So I wouldn't necessarily consider that theft right now. If it happens again, yes. Um I do um I do talk to people about it. So make sure you give them the shulker box though, because it did show you took it FPA or um so I would hope you didn't drop it. So uh yeah, that would be great. To be honest, if you didn't put a box down, then don't take it. That's true. That is very true, Dan. I mean, if you didn't put I mean, unless, you know, it's labeled like we have here. You know, people do put like, you know, donations or you know, here freely take this. But like, you know, you go into our main area here. This is our main box. It tells you, you know, please take only what you need. Starter equipment. It uh, it says everything. So yeah, you don't don't go into somebody's base and take their stuff. We have had that problem before, where Ricky Bobby had um had stuff taken because he didn't bolt down his stuff. So, um, let's see. Be right back. Family meeting. All right. Um, but yeah, seriously, a uh, shulker box is pretty important. It would be great if you could bring it back, Royad. Um, so. And uh, who? Let's see. Who have gold? Oh, we do have a bunch of gold. But it looks like Dan has a bunch of gold too for you, Ricky Bobby. So. Okay, you still don't have your shulker. What? Oh, you. I didn't see anything taken out of your chest that was a helm. Did you? Let me go back and look at that. Let's see. Um, looks like FPA added iron helmet. Added the iron helmet. Um, added iron helmet. Um. Let's see. Oh, I looked at it a couple times. That's page one, a couple times. Um, I don't see anything taken out other than the shulker box um, of real import. I mean, diamond, of course. Totem of Undying and the Lapis, I would actually say, are pretty good. Enchanted Book, actually, that's pretty important. I hope you get all of that back. Um, but I don't see a helmet. I see a helmet added. I don't see any helms removed. So, okay. So that's, uh, that's at least what those pages show. And then there we go. Um, and I'm going to do, I guess, how many th across? Two? Two or three? Two. So one, two. Oh, wait, that was one, two. Go up here and then go there and there and put this back. Hope I got that back. Let's see. There we go. So, yeah, what I'm going to do is this so that it matches because I actually like the design. There's a design I'm actually going off of here, and I do like the way it looks with this. So, let's see. Go with this. And I think uh, they're asking, ZK, I think they're asking about, because uh, they're getting gold to and from each other. So that's what that's about. Um, all right. Jump, jump. And we'll go there and there and there. And then there. So, yeah, I mean, yeah, good rule of thumb, I'll go back to it, is if, if there's a base, don't take people's stuff. 
Um, so you get pretty much one warning and then at least return the stuff. And then after that, that's, that's, you know, if you can't respect people's stuff, then I can't have you on the server. So that's just, uh, one of the main rules. So, um, cause yeah, I know someone took a uh, Ricky Bobby stuff and they never actually came back. Um, and so, yeah, I had it. I looked, used CO inspect and everything. And it was just gone. So, um, he lost, I want to say it was like an enchanting table. No, it was an entire chest of stuff, I think. So it was pretty bad. Pretty messed up. And uh, thank you very much for the uh, the follow, Roeode, on, um, on YouTube. And uh, hi, uh, Musashi. Welcome in. How are you doing? Hello, hello. Let's see. I don't know if that's just a huge delay because I think, oh, that is not what I wanted to have happen there. There we go. Um, am I actually out? Thought I had. Okay, so I don't want the comp, the powder. I want this. <laughs> so put the wrong thing up there. There we go. Let's go with that. And, uh, oh, Raf. Hey, Raf. How are you doing? So also the gravel trapped you. Okay. Um, all right. And, uh, Roeode, if you could please find that shulker box and return it. That's kind of like the most important thing they lost. Um, and, uh, and welcome back. And, uh, so yeah, it does suck for Ricky. It was, uh, I can't remember her name, but I haven't seen her like Nolly Al or something like that. I haven't seen her on stream or in games since the day that uh, that she took Ricky's stuff. So, all right, let's go with this. And uh, thank you very much for the uh, the like, Aaron. Welcome in. How are you doing, Aaron? Now this time the storm that's hitting me is going to be a lot of snow for you. It should be at least, I think, from what I read. So. How are things going up there? And how are you feeling? Let's see. And should I be doing white at the bottom? No, this is actually good. I'm actually going to do a brick kind of trim at the bottom for the barn. So it's good you're doing okay. Good to hear. All right. So, and I hope uh, you're doing well with your family there, um, Royad, Royod, Royad. What? I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it, mispronouncing it. So let me take a look. Okay. And uh, we'll go with that. And so one thing I still have to do, because every time there's a tiny bit of silence, and I'm very aware that I don't have any music going on in the background, I do need to have some kind of at least stream music. And I was thinking of just doing, you know, stuff that I won't get banned for, like Minecraft music. So I think that'll look okay. Maybe I want it to be more blocks. Maybe more like three. I think. Maybe. So 12 inches plus expected. Nothing yet from the storm. But you're recovering well. That's good. I'm glad you're recovering well. Because that sucked. So, yeah, the black ice stuff you slip and fall on that stuff it's really not good <laughs> so um so just call him rod okay that works too ref <laughs> so um yeah i'm guessing see i thought that would work with uh three but it looks almost i'm not sure maybe once it's all put together it'll look better so maybe I do want to do three wide on this, or I could do in the middle here, I could do, so let me see, it's that, that, I'm kind of again going off of another design, but I'm changing it up a bit. So nature music, I guess that could work. Anything that wouldn't get me in trouble with, uh, with Facebook. So, or Twitch actually, Twitch is the worst one. I think YouTube is okay, because you know, not in this car. But it should be okay. Let's see. So 
one, two, three, four, five. Um, can I send you a PM video of my world fell in lava, but I didn't, didn't die. Respond me somewhere else. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's cool. Aaron, um, is this McDonald's? <laughs> it is not McDonald's, but it's supposed to be kind of like showing wood paneling on a barn. <laughs> so that is the effect I'm trying to go for. Maybe unsuccessfully, because it is not supposed to be McDonald's. So um, I will maybe, let's see, I'll do this. I'll do three wide. And hey, Daisy, how are you doing? Welcome in. Hello. Let's go with this here. Okay. I mean, maybe if it's not exact. Now, another option is I do it like this, but I put in bits and pieces like I did the wall, like I was saying earlier, like, you know, just kind of like that. I could try that and see how it looks. I could also use World Guard to kind of show, you know, this is actually kind of cool. You know, I'm actually going to do that. Not World Guard, World Edit. So want, all right. So we're going to do a quick demo, world guard, world test, world, sorry, world edit. All right, I'm gonna do a wall. And we are going to do this. All right, okay, Aaron, I will take a look at that in a minute. Oh, that's second position, first position. And then, uh, second position. Okay. I think I got this right. All right. So let's do set. Let's just do a simple set to um, red concrete. So there we go. We got a red concrete wall. It's pretty cool. I love world edit. It's just fantastic. It actually made it too wide. I don't know why. Oh, you know what? I think because they weren't lined up, I think I actually put them in the wrong place. Yeah. <laughs> Shock cheating on camera, part 69. Yeah, no, this is just a test. So another option that I can do is red concrete. How is it? It goes, what you do is 50% uh, red concrete, comma, 50% red. Oh, it's not auto completing. Maybe I don't put a space there. 50% red, um, uh, red, uh, uh, what's it called? The stuff, um, terracotta, terracotta. So there you go. So that's a, another option for the design I could do. Um, and hey, uh, ZK. So yeah, this is just, I'm just doing a test. I'm going to delete this because all I can do is see the, to get rid of this, all I have to do is just set air, and it's gone. So, but for this, this is one option I can do to kind of, so that can be done. And hey, Tristan, welcome in. How are you doing tonight? How is, uh, how are the borderlands? All right, so another option is I could do red concrete for that deep red, and I could do maybe 75% and then do 25%. And, you know, kind of give that kind of old look to it. That's good, you're doing well. It's good to see you, Tristan. So, um, just uh, as far as just the percentages, that's just one way to go with it. Um, I can't do, I don't think I can command it to do striped, but uh, let's see, can I TP? Who? Oh, hey, can you TP me back? Um, I don't think he's on the server right now. Yeah, he's not on the server right now. So, yeah, it's just uh, four of us right now. Um, so that is another option. And uh, hey, Avery, back after an hour of other things. So I'm actually doing tests to see how this barn will work. Oh, and if I do it again, it will actually set. So I wasn't sure about the striped, like, because I want red paneling, I thought would look okay. I'm not sure if that's going to work for a barn. Uh, once I have the trim on and stuff, it may not be as obvious. But I was just 
playing around with World Guard to get it to kind of, you know, to show some other options that I can do. Another option is I can do Red Terracotta. Let's do maybe 55% Red Concrete, 25% Red Terracotta, and then maybe 25% Red... Oops. Red... Um, what else do we have? We could make it Red Beds. There we go. That is awesome. There we go. So we have a barn that is also... Uh, you're trying to get looting three so you can get more uh, shulkers. Oh, okay. Well, thank you. Thank you, Dan. Uh, that would be awesome. I actually only have uh, one shulker box. <laughs> Though I might have given it away. Um, redstone. All right. I can try. Let's see. Because red beds just don't work. There's no red stone necessarily. And thank you for the, uh, the like. Unchallenged, welcome in. How are you doing tonight? Um, you do like the half open door type of barn. Yeah. <laughs> um, let's see. So red concrete, gla red glazed terracotta. That could look very interesting for a barn. That's kind of cool. Um, let's see. Oh, and you know what? I've got my percentages all wrong. So it's 25, 25 and 20, right? No, 30, 30%. Red something or other. Red sand. Oh, okay. That could... Let's see. Red sand. All right. Getting... that Red sand is a little too yellow. So, um... Let's see. Red mushroom block. I wonder how that would look. There we go. Actually gives it some texture. <laughs> I mean, technically, I would have to go and farm red mushrooms. Because, again, this is, like, stuff I have to actually make this is i'm just kind of doing a test to see how it looks okay so the red nether brick slab or uh, not slab the block this is something that uh avery did on the uh big um uh apollo justice that is too different so that won't work so let's see tnt <laughs> there we go tnt there we are and then anyone who uh has has the ability can literally blow up my entire barn so that would be fun <laughs> so i will not do red tnt so let's see what else we got um now you know another option is i could do the concrete powder because i haven't changed at all and that is kind of interesting um, but I do wonder if I should just do the stripes. I wish, you know, there is a red wood. Um, well, it's more pink. Um, what kind of wood is that? So, does not look good when you have that many shades of red in one place. You're colorblind, so don't listen to you. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it, it, I can assure you not being colorblind, it doesn't look good. Okay, here we go. Red shulker boxes. There we are. There's some red right there. So we're not going to do that as everyone runs up and starts grabbing some shulker boxes. Uh, red stained glass won't work. Red tulip. There we go. Perfect. That is beautiful. Just beautiful. All right. I'm just running down the list. And hey, uh, oh, netherrack. You know, that's not a bad idea. And hey, uh, hey, uh, Cesarina, DB, how are you doing? Let's see, nether rack. There you are. I'm still a too deep of a red. So, oh, here we go. This is perfect. Ancient debris. There we go, everyone. Have a run on uh, this much ancient debris. Let's get rid of that in case someone does have access to getting stuff off of my property. <laughs> red. Um. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I will absolutely do that. Let me... Sorry. I got uh, completely distracted with this. There we go. Red wool is not terrible. Let's stare at the red wool for a second while I check PMs. I'm going to look at this. I'm going to have to mute it. Um, I'm looking at your video right now, Aaron. And uh, it's good you're doing fine. So... 
I do not need any more gravel, Ricky Bobby, but do hold on to it because it is very likely that I will need it again. Oh, goodness, that's a big fall. Oh, oh, I feel your pain, Aaron. Oh, my goodness. That sucked. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, Aaron. Um, let's see. Um, let's see. So, another, let's see. Do I need gravel? What's Dan doing? Oh, and there's still a tulip sitting right there. Just kind of sitting in the ground. Aaron, that was... Uh, you didn't die? I guess you had uh, enough... Oh, did, did you have um, either uh, fire resistance or just with your armor and stuff? That was... That's a terrible fall. So falling in the lava was almost like falling in water for you. And uh, hello, uh, Rise Micah. How are you doing? Let's see. No, there's nothing really here to mine. I can assure you. It's all just wool and uh, stuff. So, um, yes, you can join. The, uh, the the server address is in the pinned comment on Facebook there. So, um, let's see. And, oh, that's right. Wanted, sorry, wanted to respond directly. Sorry about that. I remember you did that. So... That was, okay. Sorry, I shouldn't. Let's see. Doo -doo -doo. There we go. All right. Um, so, let's see. So, other options. There, I can't remember. What is the name of the wood that is red? Now, I know this is more orangey. When you strip it and uh hey raf welcome on the uh facebook side and thank you very much for uh thank you very much for the like raf i appreciate that a ton so it's kind of funny i can go i know i missed it on twitch because twitch has the best latency so i went over to because i didn't have it up on the screen um i had to go over to uh Facebook because I knew the delay is much greater there. <laughs> so um yeah, the desert kind of tree is not the best. So if I do let me strip it. Yeah, this is more of an orangey look. So it won't necessarily work on this. So um uh thank you, Raf. I appreciate that. Um yeah, sharing the stream does absolutely help help me get a little more reach. I do appreciate that. But uh, let's see. So um, let's see. Oh, I forgot to put. Okay. There we go. All right. Let me see. So, yeah, I'm trying to figure out what the. Um, oh, that's almost okay if i did like stripes of this wood but nah the red it doesn't quite work it would work if it was more orangey and stuff so but uh let's see yeah um uh let's see just one and thank you very much for See, I was typing. Thank you very much for the like. Andre, welcome in. How are you doing? And uh, best, let's see, Ricky Bobby. Let's see. Sheriff Ricky Bobby, that's right. Best barn builds you're seeing are entirely red wool or not even red at all. Yeah, I will say there are some really good ones, but I wanted to do kind of that red and white barn. And uh, how are you doing, Andre? Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Let's see. All right, there we are. Okay. Let's see. Oh, and uh, welcome, Rise Mika, to the server. Welcome. It's always good when you see... Because uh, a lot of people don't see when I put the uh, thing with uh, the pinned comment. All right, so... I'm not sure. So here we go. Red candle cake. I think this actually might be my best barn idea right here. 
do uh, strips of that plus some red cake mixed in. I think this could be by far the best possible barn because then it's a birthday everywhere. And I'm totally joking, by the way, for those of you who don't know. Um, yeah, I could do the striped so it's like, you know, the wood paneling and stuff and, you know, have it be, you know, some of it's kind of worn because it's red and then have the red concrete be the rest of it. Uh, red wool is really not quite red enough. And hi, uh, Mark. Welcome in. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Um, and uh, thank you very much for the uh, for the like, Mark. I appreciate that a lot. And uh, let's see. You're talking about catching thieves from the West. <laughs> All right, so... Let's go back to red wool. Let me see. So the red wool, actually, that is kind of, that's a nice red, but it does have that texture I'm not sure about. What would that look like as far as stripes? I wonder. So I'm going to set this back to air. Um, and then we do have plenty. And by plenty, I mean, there is a ton of red wool. And I wonder, so let me go grab some of that. Because Avery gave us about 2 billion uh, red wool. So I do have that to work with. So let's see. But yeah, I do love um, World Edit. Just because you can do those kind of tests to see how things work. It's a whole lot faster. And for those of you who will be regularly on, the, um, on our creative server, I can give you access to, um, to World Edit. I've already given access to uh, Golden and a few others. So, and uh, look at your full name, Andre Gabby. Oh, is that? Oh, okay. You are uh, your siblings, I guess. I just noticed both of you have the same last name. <laughs> so, uh, welcome, welcome. So, and welcome to the server, Raf. I see you just joined. All right, so let's see what this looks like with the red wall in there. So here we go. And let's go here. Oh, did I do that? Yeah. So well, a red wool and stripe instead of that actually might look better, Avery. Because you had mentioned red wool, and that might be, I mean, we have plenty. I mean, way more than enough, and I wasn't sure. So as far as it being kind of the worn part. I wonder if that would be better than the uh, terracotta. So let's see what was... Uh, you can kill me in the PvP arena. And oh, by the way, we do have player heads on. So if you all do fight in the PvP arena and uh, drops, I'm not sure how it works, but you get each other's heads when you beat each other in the PvP arena. So as soon as I... We do have the arena. It's over by Tristan's house at base 2. That one works. I've not set the Coliseum yet to be a, an arena. So that could actually work. Um, that right there. As far as using some red with that red. Because though I'm not sure. What do you all... I mean, in fact, I could use all three for striping a little bit. Kind of like, you know, an accent a bit. So, oh, your player head was taken. That's right. I think you were one of the first ones to fight. So... Still the only person with world added access that broke the server. Actually, I will say Golden did break the server a few days later. Um, brought it down. I got the same message that the server was on fire. <laughs> and uh, thank you for the follow, Mad Wolf. I appreciate that a lot. Welcome in. Hello, hello. Um, and you're not siblings. Oh, okay. Um, cousins or you are related. There we go. That's what I'll do. Um, I am in a server and... Let me check on Trovo if it is still, it is not. I will pin, let me see, there we go. This is the server info and I will actually pin it in there. So it is pinned for anyone joining on Trovo. Um, it works for both, um, both versions, both uh, Java and Bedrock, and thank you very much for the uh, for the follow, Andre. I appreciate that a ton. And uh, hey, Dream, welcome in. Let's see, how is it going, Dream? So let's see. I think 
maybe I will do a few accents on this. But yeah, I will say that on the creative server, Golden did try to do a thousand block thing. Same deal, except not grass and water, which I have to say, that was very good. Um, but uh, let me get some sleep and uh, welcome to the server. Oh, stack. And also the server is up 24 seven. We have lots of uh, things that block um, so you don't have to worry about being griefed or anything. There's a, um, there is a house right at spawn that has everything you need as far as iron. If you, if you want to do it, you can skip this if you'd rather do kind of the straightforward way of doing things. But we do have over here, um, there are chests in this house over this way. I passed you, but over here we have chests with every type of armor that you need. It's all iron and then golden shovel so you can do claims for your land and then iron here for tools. And then if you want to make a bed, wow, this has been cleaned out. I need to do something about that. And uh, thank you for the follow. Eureka, welcome in. Hello, hello. How are you? Um, so, uh, so yes, I've been waiting more. That's cool. So, all right. Um, you know, I can't remember. Golden said it was uh, something crazy that Golden tried to do. And, you know, I got that same message where it was three things saying the server is on fire and the whole thing went down. It was actually so bad. It crashed uh, Tristan's co whole computer. Like whatever Golden tried to do, replacing a thousand blocks in the... It, he, Yeah, he did a thing where he replaced with something and it might have been crying obsidian. And because of the animation in the Crying Obsidian and the fact that Golden did a thousand blocks, it um, it crashed Tristan's game, crashed his computer. He had to restart the computer to even get back into the world. And it was kind of crazy. It was really funny. Um, so do I play Bed Wars or something? Um, we do not have anything set up yet. We do have a little tiny PvP just fighting each other, but nothing... Nothing major. I haven't gotten to that point yet. The server that I'm on right here has only been up for 40 days, so it's not all that old. Um, and I am growing over time. I will uh, be putting in more servers and more ways for people to play. So um, the issue with replacing all blocks in a thousand blocks square is that it replaces that minimum four million blocks squared. Yes, that is true. And these were the animated squares with that little drip, the uh, crying obsidian. So um, kind of like what you did with uh, the water. I mean, that's another one that's animated. That was kind of crazy too. <laughs> so, um, so let's see, maybe I'll do two, three, and then one, two, three, right in the middle here. So maybe I'll do one. So this will actually be use this use that what is best for wool swords nope oh nope not a hoe i guess it's going to be uh my netherite that's odd what is best for digging wool i never actually uh explored that didn't look like any of them were fast so i'm just going with my uh pickaxe so um and uh you think in some areas, if you replace air, it does a cube space. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> so yeah, it's, uh, yeah, you all have found really good ways to bring the servers down. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. <laughs> and by cool, I'm like, no, but I do like getting those discord nom um, notifications that the server's on fire. Those are always good. So let's see. Oh, the Coliseum. It is. It's amazing. Golden built that in creative and it is pretty amazing. So, um, and I assume you all have seen it. So, oh, shears. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I totally forgot. I don't have any shears on me. So that is why. Let's see. You only have 1.16 for Minecraft. Okay, Andre, that's yeah, this is 1.18, so I don't think you can join. Um, but yeah, you're absolutely right. I should have used shears for wool. Of course. How do you get wool off a sheep? You use shears. And here I am like, oh, I can't use a pickaxe or a shovel. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Dream. I appreciate that. <laughs> so, 
um some giant number yeah 2000 by 2000 by 2000 yeah that is um that is pretty crazy and we got the sheriff watching from above let's see so yeah for those of you who haven't seen this this thing it's pretty amazing uh golden built it in creative oops come on oh psh. acting like i still have my wings on um and he i allowed him and i won't do this for everything but i will whoops i did not want to do that there actually that looks better oh never mind let's put that back on there there we go perfect for some reason i was doing that all right my wings are not even in there and let's put them here so um so yeah i won't often allow for creations built in creative to be brought into uh the survival world but this one since we needed a pvp arena i thought was just perfect for a pvp arena it is just really awesome and uh golden spent a good amount of time on this thing it's really amazing so um some giant number cubed so yeah and i guess dream yeah the whole thing with me trying to figure out wool <laughs> um but uh yeah so this is this is amazing let me try not to die there's a middle area where, where we'll fight and it's just yeah golden did a really good job but this was created in creative and we did a schematic and by we i mean he sent a schematic to me i dropped it on the server and i put it in here so it's really cool very very awesome and uh going on the server and rotating all those item frames to random positions <laughs> That would be funny. Um, and uh, hello, Quebec Nordiques. Hello, the man who can't stop shocking and his tour got sent to prison for 40 shocker years. Yes. Um, you know, I've got shaders. I haven't actually turned them on, um, especially on stream. I haven't actually tried it. I should. Uh, I do have shaders. Um, I haven't uh, done it. Let's take a look. So I've got these. And I could do, like, if I do this one, I think the entire server, or not server, the uh, stream will go down. So let's try that one. Um, this one works. It's uh, It's got the ray tracing and stuff like that. And it should be, it should have disastrous uh, effects on things. So there we go. We're getting, actually, the frame rate's not too bad. This isn't too bad. Could be worse. I've seen worse. So, um, let's take a look at the pixel art while I've got this shader on. Still looks great. Works, uh, works very well with that. The lighthouse looks good. And so let's see how the Coliseum looks with the shader. I'm actually really impressed that I am getting, let's see, that's kind of crazy. I'm getting 50 frames per second while streaming on this shader. This is like the highest most recent one they've done with the ray tracing so i must have some settings off to make this actually work so um holy shock tori <laughs> quebec nordiques um you used an apk that's only 1.1 or 1.16 okay yeah this uh this shader is pretty awesome i have to say it does make things look uh kind of cool i do like how it does the water here Oh, you know what? I've got the the reason why it's working so well. I think I only have it set to uh, 10 chunks. So yeah, if I set it to more, I think I would not be getting all that much loading in. But this is actually not so bad. This is the first time I've seen it actually working, working. Now I do also have a, um, is it texture pack? Is that the word I'm looking for? Um, but yeah, this looks pretty awesome. So let's actually see if, what is it? It's resource packs. That's the word I was looking for. And I'm going to put on the absolute highest one. That is 1020. Um, yeah, the 1024 times. Now this, we're going to get like one frame per second on this. This will bring everything down right here, right here, right now. So this one is, um, it's made by, um, oh, I can't remember the name. It's actually on the thing, what we just saw. And it's uh it's pretty cool. It uh it's a very realistic texture pack. And it's already taking 20 years to start up, so I'm thinking that uh 
yeah it's really loading so between the 3.0 on the um on that other shader plus this and we're just going to be sitting here waiting so um oh the webcam is lagging it's probably because of this <laughs> it's probably the whole i probably am bringing down the entire system so let me go into obs there we go it actually did bring back a little bit so yeah i just wanted to do that so same here yeah probably me crashing the whole thing stream just lagged a bit doesn't surprise me i just put on the highest level there we go and here we go this is wow this looks pretty terrible but you can tell like, let's look at the grass so this is like rtx plus all this stuff and oof yeah i can move it like what are we getting here we are getting four frames per second at best so if i were to fly i would probably die but yeah look at the clouds it's uh this is a very good uh pack except for the fact that it brings my computer to its knees and there's a sunset that's pretty nice that actually looks really cool <laughs> so um as everything is loading in at night here so yeah this is i do like this texture pack but and there you go there's the night sky but yeah this lag is terrible so let's go back and let's take that out bye bye and let's put in their lowest the uh 128 and that should be better so and uh yeah i'm running a rtx 2080 on this computer i got it just before they all went like gone from uh from the market and i could never find anything higher anyway so i'm glad i got what i got when i got it so all right so this is that texture pack it is called let me go back it is modern arc um r157 and i should probably be running different shaders with it they actually recommend running the shaders but it's actually pretty cool what uh what this looks like oh the reflection it's actually kind of nice they haven't done all the blocks yet so there are some that are missing uh stuff so is the stream lagging with this does not surprise me oh and look there's like holes in the wall that's interesting so um but yeah this is that texture pack that's pretty nice it does a lot of good for the clouds but if i were to fly it would probably go badly so i hope uh the stream is actually not lagging now um but uh yeah so this is pretty nice it's a let me see if i can fly and uh it's actually not running too too bad i guess it's just loading things a little late but yeah this has the uh, ray tracing on it so kind of cool so let's go through the house ah hit my head let's go ahead and land in here while i change this so that's interesting um but i will take off this resource pack because it is causing tremendous lag so um you can get a pre-built with a 30 series yeah at some point because you're not technologically intelligent now i think uh you know you'd be surprised i bet you you could do it it's uh it's not too too bad though i will say with this build when i built it it was the first computer i've ever had where it didn't turn on when i built it and uh that made me very sad so running all of those now has brought my game to its knees because i did all those other things so i am going to did i turn off the wrong thing because the everything else seems to be yeah no it's the right thing i was looking at the texture blocks so um do i remember what happened yesterday i'm not sure ricky bobby so so that's that texture pack and i'm actually going to take it off because it has Okay, so yeah, I use uh, SUS, PTGI, and honestly, 12, E12 is good, and 2.13 is still kind of in their beta, and then here's BSL, which is a very good one that uh, a lot of people swear by. So I do recommend those shaders. Um, I 
do I'm a, I am part of the Patreon for or actually no not for Seuss Seuss I'm not but for those texture packs that don't work I'm on the Patreon for them so I did want to try that out so back to normal life in Minecraft without the shaders so I will uh I should look more into doing those because I do like the way the game looks when they're when it is all running so let's go back to this and I want to see how it will look with let's see which one's red concrete how it's going to look with, oh, I don't want red concrete. I want to go three across, so I want red wool. And, uh, oh, the raid, yes, Ricky Bobby. Oh, goodness, that was that was so bad. Um, I don't know if you saw that, Avery, but I accidentally started a raid, and I forgot that the server was set on hard because I was helping out um, Dan with setting up a villager villager farm or uh, villager hall and it was so bad you use cell shaders sometimes because it's pretty fun yeah actually that does sound good i have to look into more shaders because i haven't done much with shaders but the raid it was yeah it was it was a cluster it was bad so um and i like using the beeper because i don't use it that much but i've got this beeper because you know it really was a and it was bad so um, but you know, ended up surviving. So this actually might look okay. So let me do this. We're going to put in some of the terracotta back here. It might look framed or a little too much framed, but it's worth a shot, I guess. So there we go. Um, that might not be okay. Maybe I'll just stick with the wool and the, uh, stuff. And this time I'm going to be smart and actually grab the shears to get the actually no, the wool's fine. It's the terracotta that's not okay. So um let's see, red sus, yes. <laughs> so I did take hard off. I did set it to normal. The server is on normal now. And um if anyone is gonna go back into doing a villager hall, I will put that back for uh for people. Because hard makes it so that it's a hundred percent chance when you're doing the zombification thing. Um, so you want the hundred percent chance, so you want to put it on hard for that. But I forgot to undo that, so it was actually uh, it was bad. It was uh, very very bad. <laughs> so um, the Lego cell shaders, okay, are really nice. I will definitely uh, take a, take a look at that. So. And uh, let's let me make sure villager curing. Oh, okay. So, and we do have mending in uh, John's hall also. So I guess this could look good with if it were just. Yeah, I'm just not sure because I mean I think on some shaders this red actually might be a little more yellow, whereas the red and red would actually look a little bit better. Kind of like because what I'm going for is. That look of, um, which is too bad because I went and float. Whoops, he did not want to do that. Uh, okay, let's throw this, pick that up. And oh, I should just throw in the dirt. Try to put this back up there. There you go. Then I can get that back. Because um, I did a whole thing where I went and got all that terracotta. But I do think it looks better with the wool as the red part, I'm guessing. And silders, yes. I've heard of them. I've heard of silders. That's one I do want to try. But I will definitely look up uh not, not Legos. So that would be that would be good. So um so yeah looking at the two sides, which would actually be better as far as you know a barn with the tiles um, and how that would actually work. You know, I've got one side with the terracotta and the other side with the wool and the red. So let's see, personally, you prefer Silders to Sonic Ether. Oh, okay. Cause Sonic Ether has this obsession with motion blur. Yeah. I, I hate motion blur. Um, I can't stand it when I do things on, especially on Minecraft. And yes, the, uh, the Sonic Ether does have that that's that's the seuss one sonic ethers unbelievable shaders i think it's the name of it and uh it's nice 
But uh, yeah, I don't like the uh, I don't like that motion blur. I turn that off every time there's a game with motion blur. I'm like, I don't I don't understand why it exists. But I guess people like it, so you know. But as far as having that kind of tile look, because I don't want the like plain red wall. And I'm glad I did that test where I did this because that just having that wall doesn't work. Having, you know, it because I was thinking, you know, this would look nice. And by the way, I did do this part manually. I did not use world edit when building it. Um, but um, this just wouldn't work for a barn door or not barn door, a barn wall. So uh, let's go air. There we go. But yeah, okay. So wall looks better. Yeah, probably. I guess it would. Though I will say I put that one uh, texture pack on and put holes in it because the wool they made it so that it wasn't like a full block, which is weird. I've never seen that before. Um, but yeah, I will. Let me see how it looks overall. Because someone, I think it was Raf who said, welcome to McDonald's. I'm like, oh yeah, it does look like McDonald's <laughs> the other way. So with the uh, with this stuff. So let's get rid of this. I will use this red somewhere else. It's kind of funny. I thought this that red was really nice and deep until I put red concrete on there. I'm very happy they brought concrete into the game because that's actually really nice. Oh, you know, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to use wool. Okay, so that should be one, two, three. One, two, three, and then wall. Did not want to do that. So I'm going to have to do some more concrete. And where is the wall? There's not the wall. Wall, wall, where are you? Wall, there you are, wall. Okay. So uh, are there any other red block types? I mean, I ran through all the ones I could find, but some of them aren't. They don't have red on them. Um, let's see. Replace every block of sand sand tower with ancient debris. Oh my goodness. You know, we did um, put a legit ancient debris in the ground um, on my property that has driven people crazy because they can't dig it out. And uh, yeah, it's just sitting here. This is a uh, Tristan planted this. Just put it in the ground and everybody kind of wants to dig at it and stuff. This is a legit piece of ancient debris. <laughs> but yeah. I should make your entire tower ancient debris instead of sand. That would drive people completely crazy. They would spend all their time there trying to figure out how to hack the game to uh, dig all that out. Because that would be uh, 300, or no, not, it would be about 270, about, maybe 260 um, ancient debris if that whole tower was made of it. Actually, that does look better. When I walk up, walked up to it that time, I felt that looked kind of like tile as opposed to now the other way to do it would be this where it's mainly that color with those red as a minor accent so that's another option that i could do i don't know but it's time to drink some water water i do recommend drinking water everybody so remember to hydrate it's good for you Good stuff. I do highly recommend water. All right. So let's do this. There we go. Get the wall. Though I think this makes... Okay, yeah, that's fine. So then I'm just going to do 3-2, three, 3-2, two, three, two, kind of go back and forth on the sides. But yeah, that's that definitely looks a bit better. As far as kind of like the wood wood paneling goes. Oh, and I keep forgetting. I've got, when I have my wings on, I tend to, when I double click to jump and stuff like that, it puts me into fly mode. So I need to fix that. Yes, stay hydrated. Hashtag stay hydrated. Absolutely. So let's do this. Let's put these in here. And let's move that up there. Let's put this. Wow, I used a lot of fireworks just in that little bit. I didn't realize. 
And I've got a flower. Oh, that's interesting. I got a flower from, uh, by accident when I did that thing. So when I turned half the bricks into red tulips. <laughs> so, hey, it's Dev. The Super Bowl was amazing, though. I am sorry that that uh, the Bengals lost in that last little bit. But uh, did you have fun in uh, L.A. at the game? That is, uh, it was a very good game. I really thought Cincinnati was going to pull it out. But, yeah, just at the end, the the, the defense, uh, Aaron Donald was just too good. So, but um, it's awesome that you got to go. And it was just, you know, spectacular weather for uh for february <laughs> so um i mean if you're used to that level of heat this time of year so um let's see that fourth down play short pass yeah i will say uh that was that was uh yeah you know joe mixon had been doing well enough i mean though i will say the the defense wasn't um you know, i'm trying to think as far as what they were doing with joe mixon mixon didn't have that spectacular of a day i mean what they honestly should have done and burrow is one of the best running quarter i mean he's a great running quarterback he's not one of the best but he is a great running quarterback but run a rollout or something anything see what's available and then throw a pass you know make make them do something but i don't think they even bother rolling them out it was just a terrible play um, and early on in the game too, that fourth down was just, it was terrible, terrible stuff, but I'm glad you liked the game though, and had to be pretty fun. So, um, and who wants French fries? I'll take some French fries, please. Uh, there, uh, Andre, let's see. Alan is better at running. Yeah, that's true. Though I'm a Ravens fan. And of course we've got Lamar. No one's better than Lamar at running. Whoops, that is not what I want. Whoops, oh geez. So dig a giant hole in my property. Yeah, this this shovel's really good. Almost too good. Do a little tiny bit and it just digs my entire thing out. There we go. So let's see. Red concrete powder is not what I want. I don't want the terracotta. I want the red concrete. And then I want the wool, which I think I'm almost out of at this point. So we're going to do the red concrete here. Yeah, as I change everything that I did yesterday to the concrete. And then I'm going to need more wool and I'm going to put away, whoops, whoops, put away that stuff. And, uh, oh, you're a Bills fan. Okay. Lamar was hurt towards the end of the season. Yeah, that kind of ended any hopes. I mean, as soon as he got hurt, I was just like, you know, uh, what's his name is fine. The backup guy, but not, not Lamar level. So... Lamar could pass a little better. And if the receivers didn't drop the ball so much, that would be great too. So, and for those of you who aren't following, this is uh, NFL football talk. <laughs> so, American football. Uh, let's see. Let's go back up to here. And uh, But I'm glad you uh, got to go and at least, you know, experience that. And uh, I assume your kids liked it too. All right, let's see, 50 concrete, put that with that, there we go. Red wool, I'm going to need a lot more red wool. Oh, you know what, I think I actually have some in here, don't I? I do, I've got a ton. That should be enough. And now let's build another tower of red concrete, because I'm going to need it for this whole thing. So, that'll be fun. So, let's see, oh, you play QB? Oh, cool, okay, awesome, CK, did not know that um used to play whatever i guess in high school ball wide receiver okay i thought what we um and hey ricky bobby you're on uh, youtube now nobody won't be better than good old tom brady i will say yeah brady i i have to begrudgingly agree brady is uh it took me a few years to acknowledge but honestly after that super bowl uh where they uh oh here we go i'm gonna jump up this time, I'm going to aim for that. For those of you who weren't watching before, I'm going to aim for the uh, 
the uh hay ba hay bale thing. So uh let's go. But Alan Alan is great. He is uh I think between Alan, Mahomes, lesser extent Mah um, Lamar, if he gets people around him. Um, I do think um, Burrow getting back to the Super Bowl is actually going to be much harder than uh, people anticipate. I think Burrow is a is probably, I mean, I know it's somewhat po unpopular opinion, but I think Burrow is actually the best quarterback in the AFC. So um, let's see. No one talks about him like they do Mahomes, Lamar, and Josh Allen. So, um, oh, thank you for the fries, Andre. Thank you very much. So, oh, that's right. Sheriff Ricky Bobby. Sorry. I, yep. Ricky Bobby from Talladega Nights. Yes. And, uh, thank you very much for, uh, for the follow, uh, Kobe Brat. Welcome in. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? How are things with you? And thank you again for the follow. And I should do more of a uh, official thing when people follow, like, you know, just what I do with the changing voices. Thank you for the follow, Kobe. NGO. I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. It's good you're doing well, too. All right, so I am going to see if I'm going to... This time I'm going to aim for the hay bale, and I'm going to make it. So we'll see. I'm glad you like that, Kobe. <laughs> um, let's see. That's right. Yeah, what about Step Brothers? Yep, that is true. That, that Both actors are in that, in that movie too. So let's see. I think I lost uh, Avery on the stream talking about... Uh, football but I think or if you're still there can't remember because I don't know if you saw me try this before I am trying to fall on the hay bale so you love to see when people play more vanilla in Minecraft okay cool well, I'm glad you like it and uh oh hey uh hey golden didn't know you were there if you said hi I must have missed it so um how are you doing so um who did you all want to win the Super Bowl? I wanted uh, the Bengals to win. Even though the, the Bengals are in the same division as my favorite team, I felt they needed it. It was their time. But apparently it was not. It was not. So. Um, but uh, good night, uh, Golden. And uh, let's see, your daughter has to do a fashion show assignment for reading. Okay, that's cool. And Sheriff Ricky Bobby wanted uh, the Rams to win. Okay, well, hey, you were happy there. Um, let's see, and you're like, <laughs> you don't know any of that stuff. <laughs> now, you're welcome to say that, but on stream, I think Facebook would penalize me. Oh, there we go. I'm not allowed to say any of that. So, oh, and there it goes. There's Dan. All right, this time I'm going to see if I can make it. Am I wearing my wings? No, I put, again, I took them off. So it's kind of funny here. I am all the way at the top of the world. I can see the stars. By the way, it's faster to put the concrete powder in your offhand and spam, place it next to the water and hold down the brake button with a pick. Oh, you know, that is a, well, this is more fun, Golden. This is, I'm doing this all purely, purely for entertainment. I'm going to build this big tower, and then I'm going to pick it when I get to the bottom. It's pretty fast when I do it at the bottom. But this part, this is purely for can I survive a fall from the top height, which I am now at. And I'm aiming for the hay bale that's right there. I don't know if I'm... I missed it last time. I missed it by, you know, that much. So um, this is a server. Um, anyone is welcome who follows and watches. Anyone's welcome. It's both uh, Java and Bedrock. And um, and thank you for sleeping, uh, Dan. Though I will say, when I looked at that, the whole world shifting like that actually made me want to vomit. Um, so the yeah, the whole server is uh, it works for both, and the information is in the pinned comment on uh, Trovo there. So why is it blocks? Because I've got a beeper. I can just 
I can beep at any time. So I did that. Um, but Facebook tends to frown upon people who swear. They do allow it, but they will push you further if you have a PG stream. So um, I say, I don't know. The and it won't actually put it in there. So, um, yeah, I believe I can fly. I should sing it. I could do it with the, uh, with the, uh, um, auto tune. I believe I can fly. There you go. As I fall. But I can't hit both buttons, so I'm just going to jump down and hope that I hit the hay bale this time. So here we go. It's going to be close. I can't see it. Okay, there we go. I survived. I survived from the ceiling. <laughs> So I've got Feather Falling 4, and I hit that thing, and it knocked out. Didn't even knock out half of my uh, health. So that is unbelievable. So no wings. So. <laughs> um, all right. So that's, uh, that's my accomplishment for the night. Now I'll just dig all this out and get all the red concrete from the water. So see, I'm telling you, this is the more fun way to do it. Yes, there is a much faster way of doing it, but there's also the more fun way, and that was uh, definitely it. My first attempt, I missed that hay bale by about a block. So, now mine it down to negative 58 and drop from that height. I should because you get that um, that achievement. Alright, and good night uh, Golden. Good seeing you. And, did it, oh, I was like, did it actually stop making the concrete? But did not. So, one of... Uh, you remember one of Ricky's sons said, Chip, I'll go somewhere all over your... Yeah. <laughs> that, um, you want me to say that? No, I will not say that, but that is a great line from that, uh, from that movie. I do like that movie. That was, uh, Talladega Nights, for those of you who haven't seen it, is actually very entertaining. Oh, and there, there goes, uh, whoops, I didn't mean to, I broke the wrong thing. Let me make sure I get all these blocks. Whoa. While uh, Dan comes back and recovers his stuff. So he unsuccessfully, you, you got to jump to this side. Was that him or was that? Yeah. <laughs> Best MLG jump, jump ever. See, the problem is you can't do MLG. You can't do the bucket um, because I'm on a claim right now. So if you try to do the bucket, it won't actually work. But you could have landed in the water right here. I mean, it's right next to the thing. So, but nice try. <laughs> but, yeah, do what uh, Epic Gamer said. Yeah, I should. You know what? I could dig a hole all the way straight down and try to get that achievement. So, because you can go from top to the bottom of the world. So, I'm actually going to give that a try for my next... I think I have enough concrete to go to the top of the world. And even if I don't, let's just... Fill it up and... Oh, though, that'll be harder to break. See, the good stuff about this is it auto falls right into the water and I can do that. So let's uh, let's give that a try. I'm going to dig a hole. I'm just going to dig straight down and hope for the best. Um, It shouldn't be too bad. I've got Feather Falling 4. And I just fell from 300 onto something else. So, you know what? I should... No, I can't get up there. So... I am going to dig a big old hole and try to go into that. Actually, you know what? I could just, you know what? I'm going to help people out and get to get that achievement. I'm going to dig the hole next to the sand ladder and allow everyone to try to get that achievement. Though, if I put a hay bale, will that actually work? Will I survive that? I don't think I'll survive that. But I'm actually going to, let's see, I think I have enough wheat to make another hay bale up so I don't have to... Yeah, watch out for lava. That's going to be... Uh... That's going to be interesting. So let's go here. I do not have any wheat. So I'm just going to take this hay bale. I'll make a new one later. I've got plenty of wheat in my... Actually, you know what? I'm just going to do that. Pick a little wheat. All I need is nine. Replant. Always replant, people. 
your gardener, your local gardener will be happy if you replant. So, oh, like, unlike this, where people take the wheat and don't replant. All right. Oh, that was only seven. So let's just do a little bit here. Because I replanted this last night. But it is now already gone. All right. So hay bale. I'm going to take that with me. And we're going to do a whole right about... So you jump off, because you can always jump towards the water and live. But I'm going to jump towards the ladder, though you know what? I don't want people to... Well, I'll put a guard around it so that people don't die. So do I make it wide? Uh, you know what? I'll just do... We'll just do one block and hope for the best. Oh, I've got to ignore. Ignore claims. Sorry, Avery. So here we go. All right. Um... Ricky Bobby, what's your Discord username? All right, just one block. Okay, that'll, I guess that'll be entertaining. So here we go. Let's hope that I don't fall and die while doing this or hit lava or something like that. This will be, uh, this is a good test. We'll see how well this goes. And I can always teleport out of here. So that's why I'm not too concerned about getting back up. Oh, hey, look, iron. We've got so much iron nowadays. It's just like, it's like, oh yeah, there's some iron. Hey, coal. Now coal on the other hand, that's nice. So far, so good. We are at negative six. It'd be funny if I hit diamond. That would be really awesome. There's some tough. So we get down, negative 26. Oh, I fell. It's a little cave. Let's see if there's anything around. No, not really. All right, let's keep going. We're at negative 34. We are almost there. So this is going to be a hard one to hit, and I'm going to put a hay bale at the very bottom. I was like, I saw red, and I immediately thought that was lava. All right, 59. There we go. Bedrock. Um, let's clear all this out. So that, Now, the thing is, when someone comes down here, they're just going to have to ask for a teleport. Um, and hay bale, right there. There we go. And uh, thank you very much for uh, waiting for it to pop up. Thank you very much for the like, Molly. Welcome in. How are you doing? Good to see you. All right. All right. So here we go. This is going to be one hole. See if we can actually do it and see if I can survive landing on that. If you're falling with no buckets or armor, just leave the world at the right time and go back in the world. You will not take fall damage. That's, that could work. All right. So I'm going to go home, bed. All right. See the admin power, I can just do that. But most people will not. I will put a ladder so that people can get out of there. <laughs> if this is successful, I'm though I am doing Feather Falling 4. So I survived halfway. Will I survive the whole way? That's the question. So the achievement is for doing this um, and surviving. So... And this was built by Avery um, on day one and has been used by many. And there is a nether rack at the top that you give a, um, uh, what's it called? A, uh, um, when you give something to something uh, to honor it or whatever. It's 2.30 in the morning, so my brain's not working. And um, you give a little gift to the nether rack and that will hopefully help me survive. We'll see. It's going to be close on this one, I think. So you think I'm going to miss the hole? I'm probably going to miss the hole. That is very, very likely. Hopefully I didn't put it too far away that I can't drift into it. So so we'll see. And hey, Unchallenged, how are you doing? I am now trying to get the achievement for falling from the top to the bottom of the earth and surviving. And I put a hay bale at the bottom. And I'm wearing a feather falling for boots. So we will see. Um, oh, it's all good, uh, Kobe. Grammar is fine. So, um, yeah, it has been a while, uh, Molly. So how have you been? Oh, you did say you're good. Um, sorry. Could do that all night. How are you? I'm good. How are you? How are you? I'm good. So, MLG, yeah. <laughs> um, this will be without MLG. This is going to be a straight up jump from the top and land on a hay bale and see if I live. I did it halfway from 320 down to, 
actually would that be halfway yeah 320 to about 60 six or actually no it was about 70 and this would be an additional 120 so i think i in theory will survive if i can hit the hole and so here you go this is the placing the offering that's the word i was looking for my offering will be the four iron that i picked up making the hole there you go Hopefully that will allow me to live. Behold the netherrack, and that is my offering. So here we go. Um, I do have elytra. I'm not wearing it, but we're 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 gonna do this. So it's so high up. I'm looking at clouds. Usually it's great when it's noon and you see the moon when you jump straight down. And I've not played uh, Brawlhalla before, Kobe. All right. So here we go. Um, before I jump, I'm going to look to the alert so I can say thank you. Uh, thank you very much for the like, Chris. Welcome in. All right. Here we go. Hopefully I hit it. The thing is, I don't know. Oh, it's going to be close. It's going to be close. Oh, <laughs> just that much. I went back a little. I brought myself back and missed the hole. <laughs> Okay, now good news being admin again. I am going to change it when I do a new server. I am going to change that so that uh, even admins like me lose our stuff because I that's just wrong. So we got to climb up and I've got to give a better offering to our... Oh, here we go. I'm going to give a much better offering. This time I'll make it. And of course, this will get stolen like right away, but you know, it's worth it. This is This is all for science. Let's do just one little diamond. There we go. So, yeah, good point to hop on the stream. Yes, <laughs> we are. I'm trying to get the achievement for hitting the going from the top to the bottom. I put a hay bale down. I've got feather falling four. I just have to make it down into that hole. Hey, and there it goes. That was good timing, Dan. All right. If you use script, you can make a command to OP yourself via in-game and run generally as a DOP. If you need help, let me know. Okay. No, uh, actually, that's a good point. Though I could probably do it in luck perms um, because the person, uh, M. Slimmer, who hasn't been back in a while, set up uh, the permissions where everyone had, or everyone who was uh, mod and up has this ability to not lose stuff so um i do need to fix that though and apparently i'm very slow on ladders apparently there's a faster way because can you sprint on ladders nope don't think i can so all right and uh let's see this is going to be uh it's going to be interesting um, and my new entry, I've been streaming to Trovo and hey, Beans, Fervor Beans, how are you doing? Um, I've been streaming on Trovo since about mid-December, I want to say, somewhere in there, or early December I started. So it's been a couple months. So um, true, I could fly like you to get up there faster. That would be a lot faster. But then I'd have wings and then I could kind of cheat that whole getting down there. So but, uh, but I like Trovo. It's different. Definitely different. Um, but I actually am streaming to, as you can see with the chat above my head, I'm streaming to like all the places now. So, okay, you're in uh, the the Balkans. Okay, cool. Which, uh, so you're like uh, Latvia, Estonia, Lithuania area? All right. So here we go. I think, unless I have that completely wrong. Balkans, Baltic states, Balkans. Balkans are the south, aren't they? Like Serbia and places, maybe. I always mix up the two, so I apologize. Serbia, okay. South Balkan. I always mix up Baltic and Balkan um, between the two. So, yeah, Serbia, Croatia, um, those places. So, all right. Um, all right, here we go. This time, I'm going to make that hole. I'm going to get it. I'm not going to miss. Oh, wait. First things first. My offering. Don't take the diamond until I'm done. All right. Here we go. Let's see if I make it this time. Let's see. I'm going to miss. No, I'm going to make it. Oh, my God. <laughs> so the first time, I hit the hole closest to me. This time... I didn't come back far enough. All right. 
All right, so we're going to we're going to go a little higher on this one. We're going to drop in an emerald block. This is nine emeralds. So, um, which I mean, again, we've got this villager hall that I can just get, get emeralds are like, it's like getting wheat. So we're going to drop an emerald block in there. And hopefully, uh, hopefully this will work. So, <laughs> um, I need a diamond block. Yeah, that that might be the the way to my offering. A diamond block offering might be the way to get into that hole. <laughs> so, um, but no, I've I've got full confidence at this time. See, I undershot it the first time, overshot it the last time, or uh, yeah, other way. This time, I'm gonna nail it. Right, everyone. This is this is gonna work. So, I'm sure. Let's hope. So, yep. The most fun and excitement is me climbing up the ladder to 300 and you can actually see i'm halfway there at this point because i've got the uh stuff on the bottom of the screen so oh looks like uh dan missed the hole too it's not easy i could have made it wider but then there goes the challenge you gotta hit that tiny little hole it's like those um cartoons when they're jumping into the tiny glass of water from uh from those high heights you know, if you ever watched uh, Tom and Jerry and Tom would jump down and land headfirst into the cup of water and his whole body would squeeze into it. So it's kind of like what I'm doing here. I'm jumping from this high height into this little tiny hole. So, so yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see if I can make this. Yes, the content of me climbing a ladder is super exciting. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'm going up like a pro. Yeah, apparently I don't know. Let's see, I've got sprint set to be double click on... Uh, ww and um apparently i'm just too slow so i'm also old so that kind of us old people go up ladders much slower than you youngins so um hold on zk this is this is the big uh here we go let's drop that in there and let's see if this works but if you've got to go that's cool um and thank you very much for the like Raphael. all right so here we go this is it i'm gonna I'm going to make the hole this time. So, try to aim for it. Oh my god. Ah, uh, that was my worst miss yet. Yet. Okay, this time I'm not offering anything to the Netherrack. Netherrack has disappointed me. I've given the Netherrack a lot of stuff. So, actually, did I give it? Yes, I did. So, um and uh you know, I could just fly. <laughs> it would probably be faster if I do that. So, yes, I'm going to cheat. It's a whole lot faster to just do this. So that you all aren't watching me climb a ladder for 20,000 20, years. I'm just going to fly up there. So, yeah. <laughs> um, this is only my fourth attempt at this. So, yeah, at this point, I've done enough attempts at having fly on to get up to the top. I'm fully confident now that I'm going to make it. I'm going to give the netherrack the worst thing. So, oh, where are your things? Crap, because if they're not... Are they down the hole? Oh, hold on. There we go. I am going to give dirt, because that's all you've earned there, uh, netherrack. All right, let's get down so I can get Dan's stuff. Okay, here we go. Oh, come on. Okay, how is that possible? I didn't take any damage whatsoever. <laughs> I missed the hole. Yet, oh, you know why? I wonder if this is going to count. Oh, all your stuff is down here. Okay, I know why it didn't work. I need to turn fly off. Uh, here we go. Oh, other way around. Back. TP random humble to me. There you go. Get all your stuff back. There you go. And then, then I'm going to go back. And then I'm going to TP you. There you go. Don't try this at home, kids. All right. So this time I'm going to remember to turn off fly because I survived. <laughs> so um, let's see. Nether block is going to throw a curse on me now. Yeah, probably because I put dirt in there. 
So yeah, being in fly mode, that did not work out. So here we go. This time I'm going to make it, guaranteed. I'm going to give the netherrack another piece of dirt because I gave it diamonds. I gave it a whole block of emerald. And uh, we're going to give this a shot. So um, yes, Dan, you said also shock. Is there anything else? Let's see. The whole halfway also kills you. So heads up. Yeah, I've got to make sure I hit the dead on. All right, so fly off. And let's give another piece of dirt. Okay. Ooh, watch out. Are you going to jump down, Raph? Let's see if Raph can make it. I'll wait in line here. Or I'll push. Should I push him? Should I push him? Is he on the stream? There he goes. Let's wait and see. Do we get the dead message? Or does he make it? No dead message. Ah. Oh. He fell. Okay. All right, here we go. Fly mode is off. So let's give this a try. Ooh, I think I'm overshooting it by quite a bit. It's, oh, you know, you know, I should just set up TP coordinates. I wonder if I can. Let's see back. No, nah, it puts me back there. All right. Fly. Go back up to the top. Isn't this exciting? <laughs> I really, honestly, I thought I was going to get it on, like, first or second try. I didn't think I'd be doing this six tries. So, um, I should just uh, get the coordinates here and just uh, um, TP back to this location every time. <laughs> so, because honestly, I thought I was going to do that. Um, why not give it your trash items next? I, you know, I should. Well, I gave it dirt. I mean, how much more trash does, whoops. Do I need to be with the netherrack? Come on, netherrack. Draw fly. All right. Let's see. What should I give? You know what? A single gold nugget. There you go. Maybe it values gold over all else. Because it is the nether, right? So let's, let's try this out. All right. Where's the hole? There it is. Oh, I got it. Oh. I should write down those coordinates. Let's get change it tonight. So, and hey, Wacky Gamer, you're back. You forgot that you have a uh, data. Okay. All right. Let's see. What other item? I'm sure there's a magic secret item that will allow me to hit that, hit that hole. So I think um, a single fence will work here. Let's go fly. <laughs> And you know what? Let's change just to make this even faster for me. And uh, thank you very much for the like, uh, Daniel. Welcome in. Hello. Let's do fly speed three just to kind of speed things up a whole lot. And uh, thank you very much for the uh, for the follow, James. Welcome in. Hello, hello. This will get me up here much faster. So, and uh, thank you very much for the like, James. How are you doing today? And how are you, Daniel? Welcome into the stream. I am trying to get the achievement from falling from the very top of the world to the very bottom. I've got Feather Falling 4 boots, and there's a hay bale at the bottom. We've already tested this halfway, essentially, like somewhat halfway, I guess. I'm not totally certain, um, though I am cheating would get my way up there because this is attempt number seven, and I'm going to offer the Netherrack a single oak fence. Netherrack, please. That's my offering. Oh, wait, do I have like speed still on? Fly enabled. Let's do fly speed back to one. And then let's get rid of fly because if I fly on, it won't kill me. All right, there we go. Feather falling four, yes. Feather falling four. These boots are amazing, I have to say. They were a gift from Will, who I haven't seen Will lately. Um, but uh, he gave me these, and these are amazing. All right. There's Raph. Now, if I go forward, I'm going to end up pushing you off, as you almost pushed me off. All right, here we go. I'm going to do it, right? This is it. You just find, just finish your homework? Cool. All right, here we go. Let's see if I'll make it this time. It's going to be close. Got it. Yes! But no achievement. 
All right. It only took seven tries, but I got it. But no achievement. No achievement. I guess you can't have, you can't fall on that. So, um, yeah, the achievement is called Caves and Cliffs, and that should have worked, but it didn't. I can't believe I actually hit the hole finally, and I didn't get it. Ah. Uh, you all saw it. it finally worked, but uh, I guess negative 59 is not deep enough. And the problem is there's bedrock under there. Like, I can't go any deeper than where this is. So, and you made it the second time. <laughs> second try. Um, it has to be the exact bottom. Okay, so if I did, like, let me see how far can I... Yeah, so this is negative 62. So... Yeah, that sucks. I would have to be, I think you have to be at 64, I guess. Nuts. Oh, well. Well, that was a good experiment. At least we know, uh, you know, what it's almost like. Um, I'm going to see if there's anywhere deeper. This is 63. I'm just going to keep digging. Oh, did someone else? Nope. Oh, they, did they die? I didn't get any kind of uh, alert. They're not here. I heard that though. Someone fell. Um but uh yeah, so this is 63. So I would have to find I will have to find my way down somewhere. Let's see. That's going to be 63, 63. Yeah, none of this is going to work. So, oh well. I'll have to find it again some other time. Oh wait, what? That's 63, right? Yeah. And Unless people are throwing things down here. <laughs> so, um, all right. So with that, um, all right. Well, uh, well, thank you for coming by, Kobe. It was, uh, uh, I appreciate the follow and seeing you. I'm actually going to be ending my stream very, very shortly. And uh, Unchallenged, if you're still there, how was uh, your stream today? Let's see. Bed. There we go. So now I'm back. Let me see if everyone's still around there. I'm not sure. But uh but yeah, that was uh that was fun. And that was all because I'm I'm building a barn and I needed red concrete and uh I made that tower. I successfully landed on this one, and so we had to try going from the very top, which did work, but I'm gonna have to maybe try to see if I can go to 64. So oh you didn't stream tonight, you're working on oh taxes, ugh. Yeah, I hear you on that. So, um, so yeah, I think at this point, um, I'm going to, let's see, I'm going to do disconnect and go back to cropped camera so you can see the chat. You have to do all your expenses for your business, get your wife to get hers together. So lots of paper. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, I hear you on that. Yeah. Taxes are, uh, they're super fun. It's, uh, one of the, uh, the good, uh, the most fun things, right? So, but uh, thank you all for coming tonight and watching. I do appreciate it. All the follows and likes and everything. And uh, yeah, this was, uh, this was good. Um, hopefully uh, next time I'm going to see if I can get to down to 64. I mean, I guess maybe you have to literally fall onto block 64. So I guess you have to MLG it. You can't just... Uh, land on a hay bale like I did with Feather Falling 4, but it did prove that I could live. So, um, though I didn't look at my health, I'll have to review the stream to see what my health actually was when I landed. But, um, but yeah, thank you all for uh, coming. I do appreciate it. Um, I couldn't do this without you all. And the server's up 24-7. Um, anyone can join. And, uh, yep, and I'll see you later, Rebecca. Uh, thank you for coming by. And, uh, yeah, I'll be on. T so weekends are generally optional, though I might stream this weekend. Um, I still want to figure out what I want to do with the uh, with our next server, if we're going to do, like, seasons. Because I do want to keep this one intact the way it is, because everyone's put so much time into it already. I'm not going to be like, okay, let's wipe it and do seasons. I think I'm going to do a separate server where people don't have quite, like, we have mods and stuff like that with lots of power. And, I'm, and even myself. And I'm going to put us back down to the base level 
and work from that. And um, there's just uh, what do we do with PvP, whether we have it on or off. So that is uh, what I'm trying to figure out for our third server because we did the creative one. So, um, but this one will be more, I think, of a seasonal, like, reset every six weeks. And that's uh, something I'll probably put on a poll on my Discord for. But, uh, again, I tend to ramble at this time of day or this time of night every time I'm ending the stream. But, uh, again, thank you all. I do appreciate it. You all are awesome community. The server's going well and everyone there, it's fantastic. And uh, yeah, I will um, be on maybe tomorrow's weekends are optional, but I'm going to give it a shot. Yeah, an SMP reset, but not this server. I, I, I want to keep this as OG and just have it run perpetually, I guess, until like, you know, there's no memory left um, because people went to exploring too far. But I'll see. I'm going to see how long I can get this one to work. But I am going to do kind of a seasonal thing just so you know, like every six weeks or two months or whatever. That is my plan, at least. Um, but uh, we'll see. Uh, but with that, it is almost 3 a.m. And I've got to be up for work in like, uh, what is it, five hours? Or actually, I've got to be up in like five and a half hours. So I'm going to get some sleep. And uh, you all have a good rest of your day, uh, night, evening, morning, whatever time it is for you all. And I might see you tomorrow because weekends are optional, but... Uh, if you see the alert that I'm live, uh, don't forget to hit the notification bell wherever you are. And uh, I will see you all next time. So good night. See ya.